Pythagorean theorem is one of the most well-known theorems in the history of mankind. It states that for any right triangle, a squared plus b squared is equal to c squared. Most people have seen this theorem, but not that many actually know the reason why it's true. Today we're showing just that. To do this, we take four copies of any right triangle, as shown here, and then we flip them to create the following image. Then we want to arrange them in a way, like so, to form a square. Notice that the angles shown here are complementary, so that the intersection of the red lines actually form 90 degree angles, as shown below. Now we have a red square basically inscribed within a larger blue and green square. Let's go further by asking what's the area of the blue and green square. The area of the blue and green square can be given by its side lengths. So the side lengths are a plus b. So the area is a plus b squared, which is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. But alternatively, we could have also found the area from our figure by noticing that the area is just four copies of the area of each right triangle plus the area of the red square. So now we have two alternative definitions for the area of the large blue and green square, and we write it below as shown here. Now it just remains for us to algebraically simplify this in the following fashion. And then to notice that if we just subtract 2ab from both sides and do a little bit of algebra, we have exactly that a squared plus b squared is equal to c squared. And this holds for any generic right triangle. I hope that's shown some of the beauty behind the mathematical proof of Pythagoras' theorem and actually shown you some of the intuition and reasoning behind this beautiful and very well-known mathematical theorem. Thank you for watching. Thank you.